Hello, I'm Mike Ritchie, District Administrator for the Northern Pines School District. And welcome to my June videocast. As school uh, is quickly approaching uh, the end of the year and summer is uh, coming uh, very quickly, uh, I'm going to talk to you today about uh, some different activities you can do throughout the summer months on our campus here at the high school. Uh, you'll note I'm standing by uh, hole number 10 of our disc golf course. One of the activities you could participate in throughout the summer, um, if you have visitors coming or if you want to just get out with your, your kids or if you're visiting the area, come on over and check out our 18-hole disc golf course. We're here by hole number 10. We have a beautiful course laid out throughout our campus. It goes through the woods and uh, behind the high school. As you can see, uh, Mr. Josh Rohde, our uh, high school physical education instructor, is out here with his second hour class today. And uh, let's, let's hear from Josh about the uh, disc golf course. Uh, so we're here at the 11th hole of the Northern Pines uh, disc golf course. And I think the kids are really lucky and I think the community is really lucky to have this course. A lot of people probably don't know that it exists. Um, there are uh, score sheets that are available on the Northern Pines website that the community can download and there are rules on that score sheet. Um, there's 18 holes here that wraps around the whole campus of the school and I think it's a really great opportunity for anybody to come in and anything that exposes the kids and the community members to you know, get up and get active and get outside I think is a good thing. For those of you who are interested in gardening, as you can see, we have a community garden here uh, located behind the high school. Uh, it's a beautiful plot of, uh, of land where we have uh, our community members are working with our, our students uh, in developing a wonderful garden. If you would like a, a space in our community garden, uh, please visit our website for more information. But if you, if you want a garden but you don't have a space at your house or your home, uh, feel free to contact us and we can uh, give you more information on how you can purchase a plot in our community garden. As you can see, I'm now by our outdoor track. There's a gate in the back parking lot that gets you into the track. The gate is open all summer long. And I would encourage any runners or walkers to come on over and use our track. Let's go check the track out. The track is located behind our high school. It's an eight-lane, rubberized, 400-meter track. So, again, if you want to take advantage of some morning runs or afternoon runs or if you want to come out and walk, uh, feel free to come out and use our track. Uh, just to let you know that four laps around this track equals one mile. For those of you who like basketball or just want to come shoot around, we also have uh, three outdoor basketball courts. Our, our outdoor courts uh, sit behind our K-8 uh, building or kind of right in between our K-8 building and our high school. But you'll note here we have uh, three courts with six outdoor baskets. So again, come and enjoy uh, the basketball courts throughout the summer months. We're extremely fortunate here at Northern Pines where uh, not only do we have uh, wonderful uh, school facilities, but our outside facilities are second to none. Uh, you saw the disc golf course, you saw the track, and what we also have back here, we have a number of fields. Uh, we have two baseball fields, two soccer fields, two softball fields, a football field, and a football practice field. Again, we would uh, encourage you to come out and use these fields, um, you know, whenever the weather uh, permits. Uh, there's, there's plenty of green space back here, and I know kids enjoy coming back here playing baseball or softball, um, along with doing other activities, uh, such as flying a kite. There's, there's lots of room back here to fly kites, and you'll, still, you'll see people back here uh, utilizing this green space. So please uh, enjoy the space that we have uh, for you if you're visiting the area or uh, if you want to come out here with your family. Now, we're out here on a beautiful day, but as we know in northern Wisconsin, even in the summer months, uh, we do get some inclement weather. So let's go inside, and I'll show you what we have available uh, for the summer months uh, if the weather is inclement, rainy, cold, uh, or for whatever reason you want to be indoors uh, doing some type of physical activity. Well, as you can see, we're now inside, and uh, we do get some inclement weather uh, over our summer months. Uh, we have a wonderful field house. It's a 200-meter track, and it's eight laps will make a mile. So if you're looking uh, to get out of the rain, uh, come on in here and uh, check our website for hours of availability. But this uh, indoor track is open all summer for your use. We just talked about the field house and the track. Now I want to show you our indoor wellness center. It's a great facility. Uh, and to get to our wellness center, you're going to want to come to the uh, back parking lot behind the high school and come in through door 16. There's a big sign above the door that says Pines Community Wellness Center. Come on in. 
Well, as you can see, we have a wonderful facility indoors for our wellness center. And uh, looking throughout this room, you'll find uh, ellipticals, uh, treadmills, uh, you're going to find free weights, a number of other uh, devices and machines that uh, people will really enjoy using. Hours of operation are posted on our website. Hi, I'm Nick Ray. I'm a lineman in the community, a power lineman. And uh, I've been a member here at the gym for seven years. And I love the facility, I love the people. It's a great place to power lift. It's probably the best power lifting gym in Vilas County. Um, there's a lot of cardio equipment in here. The staff is very helpful. It's great to see the kids up here um, developing from uh, their younger years and then into their young adult life. I've seen some great accomplishments as far as um, athleticism and strength and conditioning. One of our premier events uh, over the summer months is called our Moonlight Run. It's a 5K run walk and so we also have a 1K kids race. Um, the kids race starts at 9 p.m. and the Moonlight Run starts at 10 p.m. The date of the run is on Saturday evening, July 11th, and it's a great family event. I'm standing next to the shirt and with the results from last year's race. Uh, we are anticipating and we're hoping to get about 500 runners this year. So please come out and support our wellness center, our community, and our school district, and participate in this great run walk on Saturday, July 11th. All money that is raised at this event goes uh, directly to our Pines Community Wellness Center and it's used for the operational and the support of the Wellness Center. It helps maintain our equipment and it will allow us to purchase new equipment when we, uh, we need to do so. To register for this 5K run walk, please visit our website at the address below. We also have a great exercise room that's right off our wellness center and this room is used for programs and classes. A number of classes are offered throughout uh, the week. Uh, they're updated uh, uh, every few months so again please go to our website and look at uh, the current classes that we offer. Also uh, members or if people come in and work out and use the wellness center, uh, if classes are not held in this room, anyone is welcome to use the room. You can see that we have kettlebells, jump ropes, uh, mats, anything you might want to bring for your own personal workout. Uh, we do encourage you to come in and enjoy this wonderful room and uh, help get yourself a great workout uh, whenever you come to the Pines Community Wellness Center. If you go to our website, you can get information, more information uh, regarding our disc golf course, our uh, outdoor track, our indoor track, our wellness center. Um, and also we have a, a website uh, if you want school information. So uh, just go to the main NPSD website and you'll get all the information you want regarding our school, schools in our district, uh, from charter schools to, to traditional schools and all of our wellness activities along with our community activities. Thanks for watching and have a great summer.